My name is Jessie and I'm an educator here at the museum with a background in art. Today we are outside looking at a big old metal sculpture. Working Point by David Hess was commissioned in 1990 by the first director of the BMI. Hess spent seven years sourcing local materials that represented different industries from Baltimore's past and present to create the piece before you. Using objects like anchor chains, cast iron lampposts, and even brewing equipment, he created this ambitiously large found object sculpture. Often, when guests ask about the piece, they wonder what piece of machinery this is, like the Bethlehem steel crane across the parking lot, not realizing that this is a composite of many of the tools used throughout Baltimore's industrial history. Hess thought of Working Point as a creature, a large or dangerous toy, or simply a pile of junk. Since the museum's founding in 1977, we seek to highlight some of the industries that have left the city and the ones that are still part of us. Standing on what Hess would call the anti-plaza that surrounds the piece, you can see companies like Domino Sugar that have remained in the city, or others like Under Armour who have been founded here more recently. But Hess's piece also calls to mind the industries that are no longer here, shipmaking, chemical manufacturing, metalworking. While some of these industries have likely left Baltimore forever, both the sculpture and the museum remain here to continue to tell their stories and be there for what comes next.